I love how in his Symphony No. 9, Beethoven gives several roles to the fourth horn, from bass line to melodic line to inner voice to becoming the vocal soloist at the end. The feeling of the movement is reverent and embracing. The orchestration is reminiscent of Mozart's grand partita, warm, dark, deep, and harmonious. This excerpt covers a range of more than three octaves, and is a frequent excerpt on auditions for every horn position. It's common to be asked to play this for principal horn auditions, since conductors often ask first horn players to play this part in concert. In my experience, you never have to play this passage super soft, at least in the concert halls where I've performed it. The bass notes need to project and form a strong harmonic foundation for the ensemble. The melodic lines, like in measures 85 to 86, can be quite vocal. These four half notes with eighth note pickup make up the beginning of the movement's first subject, first played by the strings. The four bass half notes, descending to low written G in measures 88 to 89, need to be clear and centered. To get the clearest and most open sound, it helps to say though and drop the jaw lower for each successive low note. In measure 93, the slur to the high written A flat is made easier by using the vowel syllable he. Finger breathing this phrase helps us find the necessary natural jaw movements. The scale at the end can be somewhat free and beautifully vocal, 